तो इनके घर से हम औरतों के बेट में जो बच्चा है कोक में से निकाल के मारेंगे तो इन सोरों की करो विदाई Well, as the Hindus keep with their tradition of acting like the neighboring Muslims over in Pakistan, uh, in this case, you have another instance of somebody getting beaten up and attacked for essentially insulting Hinduism and the Hindu ideology. This is on the Daily Mail. It says Indian comedian is beaten by mob uh, and arrested for making indecent comments about Hindu gods in a stand-up routine. Yeah. That's Hinduism for you. The Hindu terrorists are not terrorists, they're just Hindus. And they act like Muslims that go into a demonic frenzy when someone makes fun of their Hindu ideology or their demonic false Hindu gods. Plain and simple. And stuff like this is just more proof of the fact that Hinduism is no different than Islam. Every bit as terroristic as Islam. But in the article it says, an Indian comedian has been beaten by a mob and arrested for making indecent comments about Hindu gods during a stand-up routine. Manawar Farah Kwai, 28, was detained with five other comics in this. Uh, sorry, was detained with five other comics in the city of Indore on Friday in violence after violence erupted when he allegedly poked fun at deities and the ruling BJP party. Police arrested. Not going to do a lot of these names there. Uh, with the other performers after complaints were made by the son of a local BJP mayor uh, who was attending the event. Yeah, because there's no free speech under a Hindu theocracy. Continuing on, the mayor's son told India Today the show mocked Hindu deities by passing indecent comments. The Gadra incident and Uni Union Home Minister Amit Shah were also mentioned inappropriately. We shot a video and stopped the show by, by taking the audience out of the cafe. We then caught the comedians and the organizers of the show and took them to the to the police station. Friends of the comedian have alleged that he was beaten up uh, with his fellow comics by a mob who was led by Mr. Singh Gaur. Mr. Singh Gaur denies the claims. Wouldn't well, surprise me one bit. That's how the Hindus have a consistent record of acting when someone insults their their uh, Hindu idols. Continuing on, the police, spoke, the, the police spokesman said the FIR first information report was registered following video evidence submitted to us uh, in which the content was found to be objectionable. The men were charged with deliberate and malicious act intended to outrage religious feelings by insult. They are further charged with breaching social, di social distancing requirements under coronavirus legislation. Continuing on in the article, there had been 100 people attending the event at a small hall, allegedly without permission by the authorities. The local court rejected the comedian's request for bail and uh, reprimanded, reprimanded them Oh, sorry, and remanded, sorry, and remanded them in custody. Not going to read it on a computer. Uh, Veron Grover, another Indian, Indian comedian, took to Instagram to complain about Mr. Faru Kwai getting, being beaten up. He wrote on Instagram, a fellow Indian, a fellow comedian is in jail and got beaten up by a mob because of the words he uttered. Uh, here he is trying to logically, calmly present his case, but our systems uh, now just want to brutally silence every voice. They don't want to hear, they don't want to even argue, they simply want to erase every shred of individual thought, every iota of reason, and we the people of the greatest civilization of earth are okay with it. Yeah, and, and by the way, this is in Hindu India, and, and, and the perpetrators are Hindus. So, what's any different than what you'd have over in Muslim Pakistan when someone tries to make fun of Islam? If there is no difference, because there is no difference between Hinduism and Islam. It's, ever, it's just two sides of the same Jesuit Luciferian coin. Both of them fall under the category in Proverbs uh, 8 verse 36 and John 8 44 being religions of death, you know, being a uh, death worship, Satan worship, plain and simple. And stuff like this just keeps proving my point that Hinduism is no less terroristic than Islam. It's every bit as violent and bloodthirsty as Islam is. So anyway, I want to point that out. Remember, the Hindu terrorists are not terrorists. They're just Hindus. Just like the Muslim terrorists are not terrorists. They're just Muslims. 
May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with all the brethren. Goodbye. Thank you.